What's going on, Blues Nation? Well, exciting one last night. So we went 4-3 to three in overtime over the Columbus Blue Jackets. Um, uh, we've now won three in a row. And, uh, yeah, happy about the win, obviously. Um, as we would score the game-winning goal. Just eight seconds into the overtime period by David Perron, who's off to a very hot start to the year. Ironically, he scored our game winner two games ago against the Detroit Red Wings in overtime. Now he scores another one here against the Blue Jackets. Yeah. Um, so, we would take a one nothing lead. Goal by Robert Thomas. His second of the year. That would put us up one or nothing. And then Columbus would tie it at one. Very end of the period. Goal by Pierre Dubois. It's his sixth of the year. That would tie it at one. Um, and then. And then. They would go up two to one. Go by. Oliver Bjorkstrand. That would put them up 2-1. Um, and then they would be up 3-1. And then we would make it a 3-2 game. Go by Oscar Sundquist. Uh, his third of the year. That would... Make it a 3-2 game, and then we would tie a three-power play goal just 30 seconds after after a Sunquist goal by Brayden Shen. His 10th of the year, out to a very hot start as we enter the month of November now. Um, that one tie it at three. Um, so, and then scoreless third period, and then... Like I said, go to overtime. This is already our fifth game that we played in overtime this year. Um, and then just eight seconds in, David Perron, the game winner with assist by Petrangelo and Ryan O'Reilly. So, so happy for the win. Um, and Joni Bennington, well, was pretty darn solid again. It's been very, very good for us. So far this year. So yeah. So um, of course we'll be back in action. Saturday night. Play the Minnesota Wild on the road. So. Who we just beat Wednesday. So see how we do. It's actually the start of a four game road trip. In Minnesota. And then three in western Canada. So till. Uh, Saturday. From the same Go Blues.